Hey everybody, in this video today I'm going to show you how to fill up your car's antifreeze. With winter right around the corner, I want to make sure that you've got fresh antifreeze in your vehicle. You don't want it getting too cold and your engine block cracking. So, you always want to make sure that you're doing this task with your engine completely cool. Otherwise, it'll be under pressure. And trust me, about 20 years ago, a guy that I worked with opened this cap when the car had been running previously and coolant sprayed everywhere, burned him horribly, and he did not have to have any skin grafts or anything, but he did have um, burn cream. He had to put like burn cream on his skin for weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks. So what you're gonna do is twist this cap off. This is the reservoir. About an inch and a half below, there's a line that says cold fill max. And I always like to use funnels, mainly because I don't want to be wasteful of the stuff that I'm using. Uh, this antifreeze was $9 for this gallon. So I just want to be not only financially responsible, but who you don't want this stuff getting all over the ground, all over your car, and whatnot. So common people are they're thinking, oh, I need to pour it this way. That's not the right way to pour it. You actually want to pour it like this. That way it vents the bottle properly. So we're just going to pour it in to the center of the funnel. Keep an eye on your reservoir, and you should see it as it fills. And like I said. Be aware of that line where it says cold fill max. Take a look here. We still have a little bit to go. About another inch. Perfect. So it took about a half a gallon. It was about a half a gallon low. What happens is when you're driving over the summer, sometimes your engine gets hotter than normal and it will overflow into here and then it can evaporate out or whatnot. But uh, this is something you want to check. I check at least once a year. Get your cap on there and you want to make sure that you really get that cap on there tight. You don't want that thing popping off. It's spring loaded. So at first it might feel like it's on there, but you want to really get it good and snug. And of course, lefty loosey, righty tidy. So that's all there is. That's how you refill your antifreeze level or check your antifreeze level in your car and how you go ahead and fill it up. And this is for a 2008 Dodge Charger. But the same concept can be used for any any different uh, model or your car just make sure that you always do it when the car is cold thank you for tuning in this video